Hello everybody, my name is Christian Quick, and welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be talking about the lang file. If you're unsure what the lang is, it's basically this problem. So if I do slash give, uh, give at s, and then we're going to give ourselves uh, a block. It, if we look, hover over, it says block, that block, and that's a terrible name for it. How do we fix this terrible name and make custom names for what we want? To make a custom name for everything we want, we're going to have to go in here, and we're going to have to make a new asset directory, and we're going to go into here, we're going to, uh, under our namespace, we're going to call it lang. And inside of lang, we speak English, and my game is loaded in English, so it has to be under un uh, en underscore us dot json. And then in here, we put in quotes. And then we need to basically copy whatever the name is that we're looking at. So this terrible name is called uh, block hmh3.block. Awesome. So I'm going to put in quotes. We're going to say that the name that we're looking at is block.hmh3.block. Then we're going to put in a colon. And then we're going to put in our parentheses what we want it to be called. So let's just call it block. And that's basically it. We can comma. And then we can do this because we also, I know for a fact, we have an anna... Uh, animated uh, block, and then we also have it as an animated block. Do not put a comma at the end, and then suddenly everything will be fine. So, um, use a comma. If you ever see anything in your game that is uh, messed up, just look at what it is being called, and then just put it under this name, and then say, I want to change it to this name. Simple as that. And with that in mind, that is actually going to wrap up this video. So we have ourselves, we got block and animated block. So we have changed the names now uh, to names that we would like to see. So that is, uh, that's that. You can do that with any item. Anytime you see it, just look at what it says. If it's an effect, it's obviously going to say effect dot your namespace. If it's an item, it's going to say item dot name namespace. Just, just, just change it. <laughs> it. Just type it for what it says, change it to whatever you want, that's it. If you still have any questions somehow, then go ahead and ask me in the comments below. I'll be sure to try and my very best to answer all your questions. But that will be it for this video, so thank you guys so much for watching, and without further ado...